Little Red Riding Hood Once upon a time, there was Little Red Riding Hood. Mother said, Take this basket to your grandmother. Be careful of the bad wolf in the forest. Little Red Riding Hood went out with the basket. My Little Red Riding Hood, where are you going? The wolf asked. I'm going to my grandma's house. Why don't you give her flowers? Grandmother will like it. The wolf said with a sweet voice. That's a good idea. Thank you. Little Red Riding Hood picked up some flowers. During that time, the wolf ran to the grandma's house. The wolf arrived at the grandmother's house first. Grandma, this is Little Red Riding Hood. Open the door, please, the wolf said. Grandmother opened the door. The wolf ate the grandmother in one bite. The wolf lay down in the bed. Later, Little Red Riding Hood came in. Grandma, this is Little Red Riding Hood. She ran near her grandma. Why are your ears so big? Little Red Riding Hood asked. They are to listen to your beautiful voice, the wolf answered. Why are your eyes so big? Little Red Riding Hood asked. They are to see your face well, the wolf answered. Why is your mouth so big? It's to eat you. The wolf swallowed Little Red Riding Hood in one bite. I'm full. It's time to take a nap. The wolf lay on the grandmother's bed. He snored and slept. A hunter heard the snoring sound. The hunter looked into the grandma's house. When he saw the sleeping wolf, he was surprised. Help me, help me! The voice of Little Red Riding Hood came from the wolf's stomach. The hunter cut the wolf's stomach with scissors. Little Red Riding Hood and her grandmother came out. Wow, we are saved. Thank you, hunter. What happened to the wolf? Think about it.